Hey guys, it's Super here, and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. Um, yeah, I think I'm just gonna start doing my videos if I have hauls or whatever, like during the day. Or actually, it's it's early in the morning right now. I didn't have any like breakfast yet or anything else, so uh, I just wanted to get this Dollar Tree haul done. Um, I have stuff from the other day, and I have stuff that I just bought yesterday. Um, the first bag I have is from the other week. Actually, a couple weeks ago, because I haven't really been doing um, that much videoing. Uh, so, yes, I did go to the hairdresser yesterday, and I got my body wave. Um, shout out to Share Images. I got my body wave yesterday. So, yep. Anyway. Um, the first thing I have is... Oh. Actually, I'm going to show you. Okay, I'm going to put you a little closer to me. I'm trying, to, trying to get these videos to be better. So anyway, at the Dollar Tree the other week, I picked up these glasses. These are those readers. So I picked those up. And they have little like, studs on them, and I think they're really cute. Um, really flashable, I think. Um, I'm going to leave them on so I can read stuff properly. Um, and then, ooh. Am I getting this? Wow. That is not cooperating today, is it? My hair just wants to like... Be dumb. Okay. Whatever. Just deal with it. Um... Anyway, and then I got... Yesterday I got these sunglasses. I think they're cool. So I'll take those off. Can we stop it? Put those on. I think they're really neat. I kind of like, like them right here. Okay. So I'm putting these back on. Can we... Oh my god, I can't. Okay. This is called... Oatmeal, and this is the oatmeal and for Bangda soap. Um, sorry, I'm not good at um, pronouncing names, so you have to excuse that. Um, and it's by. Shungna Soap Works Incorporated out in California. Um, actually, that's what it says here, but I couldn't understand the handwriting. But this is what it looks like. It smells really, really good. Um, it actually smells pretty, um, pretty lemony. Like a lemon or something. Alright, and then I got... The, I got some more of these um, scrub buddies, natural gloves, just for cleaning. There's eight in this pack. Um, I also picked up more of the moisturizing foundation in medium one by Sassy uh, Sassy Chick. 
this is it. And I believe, um, uh, Darlene Michio, I, I believe, um, did a haul on this. And I did buy another one. Can't find it at the moment, so I had to grab another one. I'm going to be, um, doing, uh, swatches with different makeups in another video. So hopefully you guys will tune in for that. And then I just got some, uh... Sunbeam Alkaline AA, uh, AA batteries. Okay. Alright. Now, and then this is from yesterday. I went and picked up the, um, dog, Dwayne Dog Chapman, uh, Where Mercy is Shown, Mercy is Given book. Um... I was big, I, well, still am a big fan of Dog Bounty Hunter. I do have his biography book. Um, and this, I think, is, um, uh, what do you call it? I think it's, like, maybe this, maybe another book that he wrote. That's what I'm thinking, because I don't, because I don't think that title is, um, let me just see what it shows in here. Where Mercy show is, oh uh, yeah. You can run, but you can't hide. Uh, I'm trying to see if this is like a second. To anyone I offended with my mouth. <laughs> uh, I believe this is the book that he wrote after, um, supposedly, um, I'm thinking this. I, I think that's it because I have a hardcover autobiography by him and I think it's a different title. But, um, yeah, I picked up his book. I got really good, really good book finds this time. I usually don't find good stuff, too, too many good things in there. Um, then this book is... The Beverly Hills Kitchen by Alex Hates. Hits, sorry, and it's this book here, and it says classic Southern cooking in French with a, with a French twist. Um, pictures are really good in here. I mean, nice big book. Now I was looking for the actual. Um, Actual, I was trying to see if there was an actual uh, price on here, but it didn't seem to have one. But this is a really, I mean, this is something you would find in, like, Barnes and Nobles or something. Like, you know what I mean? Like, the like pictures are really good, big. And, um, I, uh, I collect cookbooks. So I was really happy to find that. And just want to show you briefly. I also found this, got this bag that I could possibly um, take to work or whatever. Or if I'm just doing like a little picnic or something. Okay, and then I found this book called Dangerous Grains The Divest Truth About Wheat, Gluten, and how to restore your health and this is by james bar james barelli md and ron hogan um a, a m a and uh forward by jonathan wright md and that's what this book looks like it's called dangerous grains and um it says uh Maybe the back a little bit here. It says bread makes up more than half of the total daily calories in the average average diet of people in most countries, and grains um, represent more than one third of all food uh, food crops grown worldwide. Yet the protein contained in various breads, grains, gluten. Um, contributes to long-term illness and millions of people 
uh, for millions of people, excuse me, and can um, incite life-threatening choleric disease and chronic gluten sensitivity. Dangerous in dangerous grains is renowned food allergy. Oh, sorry, re-owned food allergy and expert and respected patient advocate come together to reveal for the first time the impact of gluten grains on health. James Farley and Ron Hagen look beyond our current understanding of gluten sensitivity and cardiac and cardiac or colitic disease and explore and impact the wheat, rye, barley, smelt, camolt, uh, tricell, and other grains on the on the range of conditions. Discover the benefits of gluten free diet in revealing then preventing and eliminates associated with Colic disease and gluten free sensitivity. So it's autoimmune system in in intestinal disease, chronic pain, digestive disorders, um, infertility, or pro probiotic, preg blah, probiotic problematic pregnancies, uh, osteoporosis, brain disorders, and cancer. So that's what um, you're going to be reading about in this book. So, pretty interesting. So, um, it looks like this. Um, I mean, it looks like a really easy reader. Really good. Okay. And then this one, another nice big book, is um, Delv oh. Delvet Quincy. Uh, celebrity trainer and star NBC Biggest Loser, the 321, or the 321, the 3121 diet. Eat and sheet your way to weight loss up to 10 pounds in 21 days. Um, so, three days eat clean, uh, two days, br uh, Back to the track, eat right. One, day one is indulge any meal of your choice. Day 21, 10 pounds slimmer, completely satisfied, and the all new you. Um, again, this does not have, I was looking for um, comparable uh, or to see what it actually costs. Okay, so in here. Um, if, if I were to bought this at like Barnes and Nobles or somewhere, it would be about $26 and I got it at Dollar Tree for a dollar. Um, so this is what this book looks like. Okay. And it's basically like that. And he does have... Okay, so what it has is here. Let me show you guys. Sorry if this video is long, but I'm trying to be um, showing you things here. So, like, say, like this page says day 19. I don't know if you guys can see that. It says day 19 on it. So he's, he goes through like this whole uh, day one, day two, like that. And then, like, for day 19, be like. Rise and grand, uh, rise and grand smoothie. Uh, you know, smart one smart carb, one medium pear. Um, bake or grilled ch chicken breast. Your snack can be yogurt berry shake, and for dinner, easy you know roast turkey. Uh, basically, that's what it is in that one. Yeah, that. All right. So now, just a couple small things in the bag here. I picked up um, my my little fun bur uh, bows, Brett's that I like. Picked those up, and then I guess I got the headband to match, and I got the black, uh, the uh, black and white one. And okay, 
this is the fun. Then I picked up Sassy and Chic. Saki say Sassy Chick. Saki. Ugh, I know how. Yeah, Saki. Yeah, I'm gonna drink that. Um. Um. Embroidered nail stickers. It's 16 of these. So I picked up that. And uh, that one, it's like. Because I had bought um, press on nails, and I cannot find them anywhere. So I don't know what I do with them. And, okay, so in this one, this one is. Okay, it says on top. So, okay, so 16 pieces. So that one. And then this is kind of like, um, I, I guess they're calling it Chevron. I don't know. Whatever. And they got that. So that is all that I got at this trip. And I, oh, so I will have the, I have the receipt here and I'll give you the totals. And I spent about $14.93 at Dollar Tree. For this week, uh, this uh, shopping. Okay, so I got so all in all, I got four books, Brett's, these. Um, I'm sorry, no, I'm. This was the other shopping. This was only about. Yeah, it was good. This is probably about maybe six dollars. All this stuff here. So, yeah, that's my Dollar Tree haul. Don't know when I'm coming with another haul. Um, I'm going to actually be more busier now than I was. So, I don't think I'll be bringing you that many hauls. Um, or, I mean, I don't, I mean the videos. Uh, I'll probably bring you hauls, but not that many, um... Because I'll be too really busy to go to the store. So I'll probably wind up just going in the store. Uh, like Saturdays. So I'm off Saturday and Sunday now only. So um, I'll probably just wind up doing that. And I work on my other channel. And get some of those videos going. I I really am sorry that. That channel is taking. My foster mom channel is taking so long to put up. Um, my friend that was, uh, going to do it with me, um, yes, this, okay, I want to confirm something, this is written after his son, Tucker, son Tucker recorded dad, Dwayne Dog Chapman, calling, calling his, calling his girlfriend, the n-word on the phone so this is another book that was written after or i mean after that incident so this is the newest book and i'm so glad to find it um i'm trying to see here but it does not have oh wait i'm gonna lift these stickers it's actually probably under the sticker what this book would be cost wise um but here on the back if you see this book right here i already own i already have this one and his books books are pretty good so i don't know if he's like going back over his because inside the book i want to just show brief i'm sorry this is long but i i kind of wanted to show brief Kind of shows photos of interviews and different things that they've done. Uh, getting criminals and things. So I will actually do a review book. I'm going to start doing a series on book reviews for different books. But mostly they're going to be autobiography books that I'm going to do. Maybe that's his son's. The sun right here. Um, 
yeah, so, um, so I'm definitely, definitely got, glad I picked this up. I'm so glad I picked it up. Um, because the other book that I have by him, I think, was over $20. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Excuse me. Not $20. It was, like, maybe 15 bucks or something like that. But I'm really happy. Just noticed something on this book. It has stuff on it. It's red, and I don't know what it is. And I'm going to have to... I'm hoping it's just pen and not something else. But anyway, that's my video for today. Don't know if I'm coming back with another one or not. Um, probably going to run into the grocery store. We're out of milk. We are out of bread, milk bread, and um, we have no gas. Uh, they Something happened with, they turned the gas off for some reason. And... Um, so I've been trying to get them all day, and they're claiming that they did not get my money for the bill. So um, I had to file a complaint with the Board of Utilities. So hopefully that'll get straightened out. So right now we're just using the microwave and the toaster oven. Um, and that's how we're going to eat for a couple days, because... Uh, unfortunately, it's the weekend, so I have to wait until Monday to... Uh, to contact uh, the Board of Utilities. So hopefully that'll get straight. Um, okay, so that's the deal. So like I said, I'm going to do a store run, a grocery run. Um, and probably just get um, microwave stuff and some stuff we can eat. Um, you know, because we can't, we have a gas stove, so we can't use the gas stove, unfortunately. Um, and that's that. And I don't need these glasses on right now, and I don't know why I left them on. Ooh, wow, strong. Anyway, um, thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe. Thank you.